What's up, what's up? You know what's going on, man. It's Bezo Bezo 803 all that social media. You're now tuned in to Big Motion Podcast. Who we got in the building today? It's Lil Quest, man. Lil Quest in the building. You know what's going on, man. One of the hottest youngins in the streets right now. He going crazy with it, man. What's going on, my brother? What's up, man? What's up, what's up, what's up with it, man? For the people that may not know you, man, you know, you got the records going crazy, pop out going crazy. You know, so many other records. You got all kind of visuals out right now, man. How did you know to, you know, come out with the visuals like that? Because a lot of artists, they record a lot, but they don't really, you know, do a lot of videos to later. They might ain't got the bag right. They're trying to get the, your videos looking good, man. You know me, man. Like, my boy was like, come on, let's shoot it. You know, I had post a little snippet. Yeah. Like, everybody was texting me. They were like, drop it, drop it, drop it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who you locking in with SC the plug, right? Yeah, that my dog, man. Yeah, big shop SC the plug, man. That's One like of the a hardest godfather, in the game. Man. Oh yeah, man. That's my guy, man. A lot of good work. And he do quality work. So it's you know, a lot of like I said, a lot of people, they don't lock straight in with SC the plug. You know, they got they, they gotta kinda raise up a little bit. So you you kinda got it made, man. You got it going on. But yeah. for the people that may not know you, man, let's talk about where you're from real quick. Born and raised, something South Carolina. Something South Carolina. What part? Where you at with it? You gonna know if you're in the South, you in between, you all over. I was I was all over when I was coming up. Shot Town Baby. Shot Town Baby in the building. <laughs> all right, you know, they say all hoods the same, but you know, you still you fifteen, right? Yeah. Young young and fifteen. How how is it how is it coming up, man? What you what you be up to these days besides the music? Mm. I just be focused on music, making money. Only two things to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what what was you doing before music though? Playing video games, you was outside, you was playing ball. What what you be doing, man? I be playing ball. Basketball, football? Basketball. You nice? Yeah, I nice. Ah. What position <laughs> you play? Shooting guard. Shooting guard, okay. What what's your points per game, man? What we talking? Nineteen. Nineteen? Yeah, okay. shout out Coach Tyro. Word, what what team is that? Something the ballers. Okay, big shout out to something the ballers, Coach Tyrone. We got we got the 19 points per game in the building. Hooping and balling and rapping. So that's hard, man. So let's talk about your first introduction to music. Not necessarily doing music, but when was the first time like you you're one of your favorite songs? Like you might have heard your mama playing or one of your cousins playing it. Before, by, by before not not by you, just uh, any artist in the industry. Before you was doing music, like when you was younger. No, like, I ain't. Like you really loved it, real. Like, man, I like whatever this rap is, the hip hop. I like this right here. See, see me. I grew up listening to Lil Wayne. Are you a Wayne fan? I ain't no fan of him, but like, yeah. that no, I've been playing. Yeah, 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 okay. Wheezy, top five in the game. That's what's up, man. So when when did you decide you gonna get in the booth? Was you in the cipher at school, or was you? Nah, look, look, look. So like, my dad, my pops, doing my brother. Mm-hmm. They they rap, but like, it's like. They had it in them, but like it, like I don't know if they took it serious or not. So like, yeah, I always grew up that want to be a rapper. Mm. When you when you were, when you uh, wrote your first rap, I was rapping for a long time. I'm talking about like seven, eight years old. Mm. Been doing it, been under, doing it under been the bed it. with it. Yeah, of course. When was the first time you went in the booth? I probably like twelve and yeah, about twelve. Yeah, what what song was what song was that? You remember <laughs> my homeboy. Mula, yeah, yeah, hit me up. He was like, "Come on, let me do a remix to that song, villain." Yeah, and yeah, yeah. You know, he yeah. had locked me in. Word, that, word, that word, bro. That's what's up, man. So, what what was the response when you when you put your your, per, your first you know music out? Was it, was the people going crazy? What, what was they saying, man? See, like, look, my first video it had hit like hit like two K and like. Three days, so like mm. that would really have made me start rapping for real. So that, that that was the what was the name of that video? It was called Villain. Villain, okay. So that that was the point where you was like, okay, I'm about to take it serious. Nah, I can't even say that. Yeah, I start. Let me see. When I had made that me versus the, the me versus the world. Yeah, that when I start going in for real. Mm, what, what 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 happened? What what made it? What made that song the one that make you be like, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me let me get serious about this thing right here, man. Cause like, I had um I had posted a snippet and it had got ten k in one day, so I was mm. like, mm, talk to me nice. Mm. What would you post a snippet on? 
Instagram. Instagram? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I see you do the like the uh, thrillers and all that. The thrillers, whatever, whatever, what we call those things? The video? Yeah, thrillers. Like a lot of artists don't utilize that kind of stuff, but like you can use stuff like that to kind of test a record to see, you know, see you know, people mess yeah, up. yeah, yeah. Then you can go to the video or whatever. So, how, how you know to do stuff like that, man? That's smart. Actually, my brother put me on trailer. Like, yeah, I ain't, I ain't had no how to use okay, it. Okay, big, big shot, bro, man. That little bro, big bro, big bro, big shot, big bro, man. That's hard. That's hard. That's hard. Man, keep doing that. Cause like I said, that's a good way to test a song out to even know whether it's worth even spending money on a video. Yeah. So, you know, keep keep doing your thing with that, man. So, me versus the world drop. You like, yo, I'm about to lock in. I'm going crazy. What happens after that? Walk us, walk us through the journey, man. All right. So, look. Yeah, I had on, um, after me versus the world, you know, I had hit 10K yeah. on that. And then I had a song I made when I was, like, in seventh grade. Mm -hmm. And it was, like, off of a sample beat of that cup of coffee. And, like. Yeah, I heard that joint. I like that. My mama, she had told me put my sister on them. Yeah, I see that. Yeah, you know, my sister, my sister locked in. She the one really got me going right now. Yeah, yeah. So me versus the world came, then cup of coffee came. Yeah. Worry, 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 man. That's what's up. That's what's up. So you know you got little sis on the joint going crazy. You got a whole team, man. Little three, he going crazy. Yeah. Uh, PSG little Ty going crazy. Shout out my boys. Yeah, man. You know. How how is it having a team? Cause a lot, a lot of artists don't have a team. It just be them. Cause like, see, I had I ain't gonna say I I forced them boys to rap, but like once I first heard Lil Tyra, yeah, I was like, man, come on, come rap, bro, come rap. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. He was a little hesitant at first. Yeah. Oh man, he, he nice though. Yeah, that my dog. Yeah, he got some bars. Little three nice too. Got some bars, man. That's my dog. So you too. you you was like the main influence though with the, with the music. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. I see in one of your songs you say, I wrote the song in 10 minutes. You work yeah. fast like that? Yeah, I had to write that song for 10 mm, minutes. What, what's the vibe when you when you, when you you going through your, your creative process? How you pick your beats and all that? Like, I really I really write music late at night. And like, Yeah, yeah. Like, if I get goosebumps, that's how I know it's a good beat. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. And it, 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 it automatically come to you. Yeah. Where, where, who you, what, what producer you locking in with right now, man? Shout out Zerod. That's my dog. Yeah, yeah. He from around here? Yeah. Okay. Big shout to him, man. Who else? Who else you locking in with right now, producers wise? That's my only man. That's the only man I go to. That's good, man. It's good to lock in with one producer because y'all can kind of get to know each other and build a relationship. He you know the way your style is. You know his style. And y'all can really lock in, man. So that that's hard, man. Where, where you recording that? Cool. Me, I work. At, see, right now I'm working on my own studio. Yeah. Okay. What, what were you previously recording that though before, before your own studio? Zeron. Okay. Okay. Word. 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 Man, you you lock in by yourself, or you like to have the homies in there with you, or you just see like look like if I want to get elk up like real elk, I will bring my boys. But like yeah, if I'm on like some sad type music, I'm gonna yeah. go by myself. Like that. Like that thug crowd joint. Yeah, that's hard, man. You, you, you know, talking a lot of deep stuff on there. It's good that you be able to, you know, be versatile like that. You got the stuff for the streets. You got the, you know, club type records, and then you also have, you know, records that's really talking to real life situations, man. You know, how how important it is for you to have that balance in your music? It be getting hard sometimes. Could be like, I be saying hard stuff, but like. I'd be like, I ain't gonna say that. I'm gonna mm. say something that hit the soul for real. Mm. Mm. You know, some of that, some of that hard stuff, it gonna go over quicker because you know that's what that's what they, they would want to hear. The other stuff, you gotta be somebody that's really listening. Yeah. So you know, you gotta constantly fight that battle and find that balance. You know, with with the, with the lyrics and the bars, man. So what what's what's been so far on, on the journey, man? What's been one of the things you learned so far with this music business, man? You think one thing I learned, I'm the people, hold up, the people that you locked in with right now is not gonna be your friends later, bro. Mm, mm, that's a bar right there, man. For anybody listening, man, you might start with certain people, but as you rise, certain people may not be with Some you. Some people, they're gonna start breaking off, yeah, because you know, you, you gotta grow equally. So yeah. if, I'm, if I'm growing like this and you ain't growing at all, yeah, you know, we gotta break part. There's no love lost, it's all good. 
Yeah, that, ain't but no that, love. But that's just business. That's just business, man. We talking business now. Especially when you're trying to build something special. So uh, I definitely understand you on that, man. But what 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 was one of your greatest accomplishments so far, man? In your, in your career, man. Uh, Tootsie, Tootsie hit me up. Mm, what was that like? I ain't go cap. I've been jumping through the. I've been jumping through the house. Yeah, he got that favorite song joint going crazy right now. Yeah, everybody love that joint, man. That's a crossover record, man. He's selling out stadiums. What? What? Walk us through the moment though. You was on. What? You was on your phone. I was doing my, no look. I had posted song with me and my sister, and yeah. then, like I just had posted and log on Instagram, and then like I had seen no cap had hearty. Yeah, big shot no cap. He hard. Yeah, then I had seen Tootsie and like. I didn't see the message. I was like, he texted me. What did it say? Yeah, I think it was like, he had to say, let's work together. You're very hard. But, like, he was basically saying, I'm not connected with enough people. Like, the. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, hey, man, keep working, man. That, that's hard, man. When you got people in the industry paying attention to what you got going on. So that, that just means you got to keep going. It's not going to happen overnight, but you got to keep working, keep going, man. How often you in the studio with it? Like, probably like two times a month. Mm. Good, two times a month. How many joints you do when you lock in? Probably like three. Yeah, okay, okay. How many joints you got all together in, in the vault? Probably like eight. Okay, okay, okay. Still working. You got a lot of videos out right now. The streets going crazy. You doing any shows yet? Nah, I'm still working on that. Yeah, you got you got to practice, man. Make sure you're ready. Yeah. When, the, when the call come through, got to be ready, man. I like that pop out joint. That joint go hard. And uh, so what, what's what's next for you, man? Twenty twenty three is here. We we in the second quarter, about to go into the third quarter, man. What can the fans look forward to next from Lil Quest, man? You got more videos on the way. You got a new project on the way. Talk to the people real quick. Yes, I'm about to drop SOS. So be ready. Mmm, that's a new single. Yeah, new single. Visual coming too. Yeah. When, when we can we expect the visual? In about two weeks. Two weeks. About word, two word. weeks. Word word. SOS on the way right now, man. So you know what? What was some? What's who are some of your musical influences, man? That you, you kind of you know look at, as as you know people artists you look up to or you kind of listen to. East Geese, mm. Rallo, and No Cap. Mm. No Cap be flipping them bars around, man. He be having catchy stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's hard, man. So that, that's that's who you that's who you bumping right now. Yeah. Word, word. That's hard, man. Big shout, Rallo. East Keys. I got to get up on East Keys. I ain't up on him yet. I'm up on Rallo and No Cap, though, for sure, for sure, for sure, man. That's hard, man. How, how do you, how do you, uh, I know you're getting a lot of love out here, man. People noticing the music. How do you balance all that, man? I know the females going crazy. How, how do you, you know, how you balance all that? Stay focused on the, on the work. Because it's like, girl, you talking about girls? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Girls gonna come and go. Ah, I like I that ain't. answer. Hey, I like, hey, I like that answer. <laughs> Girls gonna come and go. <laughs> hey, hey, keep that mentality, man. Girls gonna come and go, man. I ain't worried. You about keep that. that mentality. You go, you go far, man. I promise you. <laughs> the bigger you get, the more gonna come. So don't worry yeah. about that, man. That's hard. That's hard. That's hard, man. So we, we got something to say? Nah. Oh, okay, I thought I was about to say something. So, man, if 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 it's twenty twenty three, December thirty first. And you want to look back on this year right here, man. What is something you want to look back and feel like you accomplished with the music? Since, uh, hold up. Something I accomplished. Yeah. Push out more videos mm. in one year. Mm. Yeah. I mean, what that look like? How many How many you want to push out before the year's out? 20. 20 you right now. You got to be working, working. Yeah. That's hard, man. That's hard, man. That's big, man. A lot of... A lot of people, you know, they got the talent, but they don't got the work ethic, man. So where, where's the work ethic come from, from what you think, for you? Uh, you no, know, my dad always tell me, yeah. have your foot on these boys' back. So. Mm, big shout to Pops. <laughs> giving, that, giving that good advice, man. Yeah. I look at it like, man, when you're when you, when you when you're trying to do something like rap, there's so many people doing it, you got to figure out a way to stand out. And one of the ways you can stand out is by outworking everybody. You know, if he, if, if, if he putting out two videos a month, I'm going to put out six. Yeah. So you can't you, you ain't never gonna be able to catch up with me. You know, I'm in my own lane doing my own thing. Ain't like I'm necessarily competing with you, but you gotta outwork the people that's doing what you're doing so you can stand out. So 
that's a good man, mentality you have, man. I definitely big that up. Definitely big that up, man. Yeah. So what, what's what, what's your favorite? You know what, what's the favorite thing you like about you know the music industry, man, and rapping, man. Uh, you like shooting the videos the most. You like writing yeah. the most, recording. What you like the most? I really like shooting videos because like yeah, it really so all the love. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You 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 play your own video. You write your own treatments. Like how the video gonna go? You direct your own videos. Nah, I just yeah. tell SC the plug. Make sure it's hard. SC the plug in the building, man. Big shot SC the plug. That boy go hard, man. That's what's up, man. Man, you know, with so many things going on in, in, in rap, man, in the streets and rap and rap in the streets, man, how, how how do you make sure that you stay focused on your mission and don't get, you know, get sidelined by the haters or, you know, people just trying to be in the way? My mama be on my back. I ain't going to lie. Yeah, big mama. shot mom, Dukes. <laughs> That's very important, man. I know, I know. How, how, how do you, what's your plan? How you do that, man? How, how you, how you, you know, stay focused on the mission and don't get sidetracked by the haters? You know, the haters going to come. The, the bigger you get, the more haters you're going to get. All right. So if like, you ain't got no haters, you ain't popping, man. That's what I know. Yeah. But, like, it's like, uh, if I ain't got no haters, that means I ain't working hard enough. Right, 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 right. And like haters gonna hate. Yeah. I ain't trying to move y'all out of something. I was trying to move yeah. my people out of something. Mm, that's a good that's a good way to think, man. Cause you know, the internet, social media, you know, when I was coming up, if I had a problem with somebody, if I ain't see him, there's no way for me to say nothing to him or do nothing to him. But now I can get on Instagram. You can get on, you know, I don't know, you probably ain't on Facebook. You you younger than me. You, nah, that's that's Facebook, old, okay. Facebook. Facebook or Snap, and you could throw it, somebody could throw a shot at you. But back when I was coming, we had that. So we had to actually see you somewhere. And you probably never see him nowhere. That, that real on site. <laughs> that, that was that real on site. And by the time I see you, I probably ain't mad no more. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm telling on myself right now how old I am, but that's how it was back then. So uh, how how is it being a rapper? And, and navigating the internet these days, man, because you got so much going on, on that internet, man. It's like you just got to watch by what you post. Watch yeah. out for what you post. Yeah, because you got a lot of lot of guys being incriminating themselves on that, man. Yeah, because like you can't mess up. Yeah, you can't afford to mess up. Yeah, that's hard, man. That's hard, man. SOS video on the way. We got little quest in the building, man. What 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 you say? One of your biggest songs so far, man. Most hated. Most hated. Mm. Most hated. Let's talk about most hated for a minute, man. What, what what what's the meaning behind the song? What's the what was the writing process with that? See, like everybody, everybody thinking we 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 had this and that song. We did not this. Yeah, we just saying we most hated. Now clear the air, man. Clear the air. It's no beef with nobody. Yeah, there's no static with nobody. Yeah, chilling, making word. money. So how how you feel when the joint start going up? I was happy. I was like, no, yeah. they really mess with this. Cause like we had write that song like while we've been in the in yeah. the studio. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's hard, man. Most hated going crazy. I like that pop out joint too, though. Yeah, pop out me and Ty. Yeah, right that, that feel like summertime. That feel like you know. It feel like one of them joints right uh, there, man. Tell them boys to pop out. Yeah, yeah. When you when you in, when you and PSG Ty in the studio, y'all kind of be competing a little bit. See who write the hardest verse. Nah, that twin like. Yeah. I helped him. He helped me. Okay. Ain't nobody had to go rewrite their verses or nothing like that. Nah. All right. That's good, man. That's hard. That's hard. That's hard, man. So before we get out of here, man, I ask all the artists the same question. So I got to ask you this question before we get up out of here. You know, top five rappers dead or alive, man. Who you got? Who you running with? Like, this overall period. Top five dead or alive. Who you got? I'm not what? saying young boy. I'm not saying young boy. I, I thought you was going to say young boy. Nah. No, y'all love that young boy. I got no cap. No cap. Rallo. Rallo. Uh YTB Facts. Mm. Uh Lil Baby. For sure. Mm. And J. Cole. Okay. You threw me off with the J. Cole. Okay. J. Cole. You like J. Cole? Yeah. All right. That's kinda he like be my speaking era. that wisdom. Yeah, word, word, man. That's hard, man. You know, I, like I said on the song you got Thug Cry, man. You, you know, you, you you kinda got a little personal on that record. And um and then you got other songs like Pop Out where you just talking to the streets and you really 
got a lot of energy and all that, man. Can we can we expect more songs like Thug Cry from you? Yeah, they gonna feel it, SOS for real. Okay, where you got a full project coming? Working on it. Or you got a name for it yet? Nah. Okay, where can we expect this year? Yeah. All right, word, word. We're going to be looking forward to that, man. When you get the full project ready, man, you come back, Big Motion Podcast, let us know all about it, man. What's your social medias? H3. That's Instagram? Yeah. Heartless, heartless, look, heartless dot little quest. Word. But a three for the E. Word, word. Y'all make sure y'all so follow Lil Quest everywhere. He got songs on Apple Music, Spotify. He got videos going crazy on YouTube. Make sure you stream all the music. All that good stuff, man. You got any shout outs? Shout out to the fam. Shout out to the fam. I all want the you, I, I, I want you to do one more thing for me, man. Just for all the youngins out there, they want to rap. Maybe they, they trying to figure out what they, they playing ball. They want to rap. They don't they in the streets. They don't know what they want to do. They just trying to figure it out. You see that you got your mission figured out. What's your advice to them right now? That youngin, he in his room right now. He frustrated. He trying to figure out life. He trying to figure out what his next move going to be. See, what, what's, your, what's your advice to him right now? Go wherever best fits you. Like, mm. don't follow the crowd. Mm. See, like me, they label me the partisan nigga and something right now. Mm, talk it. Pop it. I ain't gonna lie. The hardest in the city right now. Little Quest. I ain't going to lie. Like, yeah. I, I had worked too hard to get here. I ain't going to lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Worked too hard. Yeah, yeah. That's hard, do, do whatever fits you. Yeah. Do whatever fits you, man. I like that message to lead the people with, man. It's Big Motion Podcast. I go by the name of Bezo Bezo 803 We got Lil' Quest in the building. SOS single on the way. Y'all stay tuned. Stay we out, y'all. We out.